You've got kale, you've got eggplants, snow peas, carrots. This is all grown by New Albany High School students. And it's part of a collaboration between the school and Let Us Learn, which aims to give back to the community through access to food just like this. I've just been out here watering. It's nice to get away from the classes. I get to come out here and do hands-on work, get really dirty. And I mean, it's pretty nice for me. I enjoy it. The collaboration is called the Youth Harvest Project. Joshua Harden and CJ Linney aren't just getting their hands dirty. They're planting seeds for their futures. And I also get a pathway done, which is required for me to uh, graduate school, which is awesome. Gina Brown founded Let Us Learn. She says removing barriers to food access starts with education in this greenhouse and in the community. You go to the grocery store and you might want to try a new vegetable, but if you've never had it before or don't know anything about it and you're on limited income, you might not try it. Brown says this garden contributes to the more than 5,000 pounds of produce a nonprofit donated last year. But if you've ever tried gardening, you know sometimes plants don't grow. Brown says that's not a failure, it's another lesson. Dealing with disappointment or dealing with you know, this didn't work, so we have to try something new, and, and that's life, right? Linny and Brown say they like knowing the fruits of their labor will help someone in need, and the skills can help them provide for themselves if need be. It feels pretty good, because I know it can also help me if I don't have anything, but I mean, it's pretty good food. It's honestly just the experience, knowing how to do it, just, it's all just gonna be nice. And I'll be able to teach my kids whenever I get older. In New Albany, Norman Seawright, WLKY News.